thousands of miles, spending thousands of dollars to see these things. Now it is completely dark here, and, and I have to say, it is quite an awesome feeling. I can imagine if you're a rural farmer in central China right now and you have no idea what's going on, you'd actually be quite terrified. Uh, the Chinese government has done its best to educate people about what was going to happen. So hopefully most people in the city do understand what was going on. But here on Yongshan Island, we are now in complete and total darkness in the middle of the longest, solar, total, longest total solar eclipse of the 21st century. Yeah, that, that is quite amazing. It is literally dropped into to pitch, uh, pitch black. It, 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 it's, uh, you, you've obviously had to turn on, turn on your lights so on the camera, so it would appear that you were, were broadcasting at night time. And just to confirm and, and to tell our viewers, what time is it where you are, Emily? Anna, it is approximately 9.38 where we are on cold totality should last till about 9.43. So we've got uh, a few more minutes of this, and that was what was so special about this eclipse. This is the longest eclipse of the 21st century. In other places in the world where you can actually see what is going on, this is enabling scientists to observe the atmosphere around the sun called the corona. It is millions of degrees hotter than the sun, and only under these circumstances when the moon is completely in front of the sun can you see the atmosphere around it and can